foot, spin around, jump. Welcome or welcome back to Three Kids in a Home. I am Tiffany and for today, this is Vlogmas Day 8. Now today, my children and I are going to be playing a few TikTok games to see which one of these are actually going to make it to our Christmas Eve dinner this year. The three games that we're going to be playing are going to be Tic-Tac-Toe Relay, Grab the Cup, and Shovel the Snow. So for my family members who are watching this, you all actually get an advantage because you're going to see ahead of time what I'm actually going to be playing for Christmas Eve dinner but don't worry as you know I already have a few in my back pocket that you will not know about so at the end of each game I'm going to ask my children to rate this on a rate them on a scale of one through five and then they're going to vote on which one we're actually going to play for our Christmas Eve dinner so for those of you who are visiting my channel for the first time I just want to say welcome to you all I am Tiffany and on this channel I do all things home decor cleaning DIY and organization with a little bit of lifestyle sprinkled here and there so if you like what you see today make sure you go and check out some of my other content and please consider hitting that like and subscribe button and for those of you who are joining me again this week thank you all so much for coming back to support me it means so much to me I hope everyone's holiday season is going well and for those of you who are experienced hardships I pray that you are finding the comfort and the strength that you will need to get through this holiday season now we're going to go ahead and get started. For the first game that we're going to play, I'm going to go ahead and just clear out a little bit of space so that way they have some room to run around. So this next game is going to be tic-tac-toe relay. So basically you're playing tic-tac-toe, except the object of the game is you're going to race to put down your X's and O's. Now I already have X's and O's on hand from another game board in my home, but you can also use like plates or any sort of other objects if you don't have any readily made X's and O's on hand. So basically you're, the two players are going to race against each other to place their X's and O's down and whoever gets tic-tac-toe first is the winner, just like your classic tic-tac-toe game, except you're gonna be doing some work. Exercise fun. For my tic tac toe board, I'm just going to be taping some painter's tape to the floor. Everyone is starting from the same point and on my signal they are going to run and try to be the first to get tic-tac-toe. Ready? Yes! On your mark. Get set. Go! They like this game so much that they decided to play the best 3 out of 5 and the rating they gave it was 4.8 out of 5 which is pretty good. So for this game, this game is called Shovel the Snow. 
In this game, the objective is to be blindfolded. You're gonna give every player a certain time to be able to scoop as many cotton balls as they can into their bowl, and whoever scoops the most is the winner. Or you can even play this without a winner just to get some good kicks and laughs for seeing who's trying to scoop what, what they're actually scooping. So we're gonna go ahead and try this one out and see how my children rate it. To set this up, I'm just taking one big bag of cotton balls and just spreading them all across the table. I just want to point out that this is the incorrect way to do it, but she tried it. So they were each given 30 seconds and they went one at a time to see how many snowballs they can scoop into their bowl before the time limit is up. Next up was our son's turn and he had a little bit more of a careful approach to collecting the snowballs. I honestly think he could see, but I guess I'll never find out. So as you can see, my son collected a few more cotton balls and they rated this game a 3 out of 5. So for our next holiday party game, we are going to be playing Grab the Cup. This is a version of musical chairs where you place cups on the ground, players have to stand around the cups, and there's a person who gives a command, so they'll give a command of like heads, or everybody touches their head, shoulders, everybody touches their shoulders. When the person yells out cup, you have to try to be the first person to grab the cup and whoever ends up with a cup in their hand moves on to the next round. Now we are only playing with our children today so essentially for this one whoever ends up with the cup is just going to be the all out winner. So we're going to go ahead and give it a try and see how they like it. So we are going to go ahead and we're going to get started. Alright y'all in the ready positions? Hope y'all. Yep there you go. All right, head, knees, foot, spin around, jump, touch your shoulders, touch your ears, cup. <laughs> okay, so we have completed all of the games. My children have voted, and they have both decided that the game that they would like to play at our Christmas Eve dinner is da 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 grab the cup. They both really enjoyed this one. They also really enjoyed tic-tac-toe relay, so we might play that one as well, but we will definitely be incorporating those into our Christmas Eve dinner this year. Thank you all so much for watching. I just want to take some time to mention just a few honorables as you're considering games for your holiday party. Uno is always a lot of fun. I always keep a deck of Uno cards on hand for everybody to get into. You can also play Christmas charades. This is where you pick a phrase and you act it out and a lot of times we'll do this in teams so with Christmas charades you know somebody will get up for the team and they'll act it out and the team will have to guess what the phrase is um, so that's always another fun one as well but that is going to be everything for today's video you all I will see you all tomorrow for a vlogmas day 9 where I'm bringing you all 12 days of content as we head into the holiday season I hope that you all have a very wonderful evening I will see you all next time be blessed bye